All right, you guys might remember my uh, previous uh, robot car. I made a few upgrades since then. This one here was kind of messy. had a lot of wires going everywhere. And you see I even got it disconnected partially here. Not really using it anymore that much. So anyway, I upgraded and refined it a little bit. And got a different car. This is a Runt Rover from Servo City. This is the that's the uh, chassis that it that it's sitting on there, and uh, you can see I've made a few modifications, uh, kind of refined it a little bit and cleaned it up. Got rid of a lot of excess wires and such. Um, you'll see here on uh, underneath the bottom of it, there's the uh, Arduino there, uh, Arduino Mega, and it's actually sitting inside of a um, uh, Sun Founder enclosure, plastic enclosure there, and mounted to the chassis there with a couple of screws just a one here in the back and then there's another one in the front that it's screwed to the to the chassis to and then on top here you got your motor controller which is the uh, L293D uh, motor controller and over here is the HC06 uh, I'm sorry, uh, the uh, U-Box 6M uh, GPS module right here. And got a, a little servo motor right here for future use. And then here is the uh, HC06 uh, Bluetooth module uh, that it connects up to. And just got a simple on-off switch right here. Turn it on and off with. And you got a uh, mast um, right here that was really designed for a, um, a, dr a drone, a quadcopter. And sitting on top of it is the uh, HMC 583 magnetometer. Um, got it set up here to keep it away from the motors for any um, inter interference from the motors or anything. And um, anyway, turn it on and everything is... Uh, Looks a lot, looks a lot better.